Now that you've created a project on your calendar, let's finish setting it up. First, you'll want to give your project a name. This shows up on your project card when you're in the calendar view. In this example, the name of the email marketing campaign is May Gymnastics Newsletter. Next, you'll want to update the other project card details so you can see the big picture of what you're working on and what's coming next in a glance. First, you'll want to choose a project type. This helps you understand the kind of content you'll create without having to click on into the project for more details. This shows the tactics that contribute to your marketing strategy and highlights the project frequency so your strategy can be more balanced. For example, you can see exactly how many emails you plan to send and confirm if you're sending too many or too few to your audience. You can also assign a color label, project owner, and tags to your project to add more details as needed. Another benefit for customizing this metadata on each project is that you can create saved, filtered views of your calendar using color labels, project owners, tags, and project types. You'll learn how to do this in a future video.